at my middle school, I wasn't getting the education I wanted or would need down the road for college. Teachers were distracted, students could leave the classroom, even leave the campus for the whole period and then just come back and no one would know besides the students themselves. I was taking classes at the local high school that I was planning to attend and it was no better. Whole class periods with the students on their phone, not doing anything and with no assignment to be done. I decided to look at the alternate private school. I applied to St. Mary's Academy, a local, er, a Portland preparatory high school that helps students when it came to college. This had extra classes and amazing extracurricular activities for students that would give them a step up when they want to apply to colleges that have all around the country students wanting to go there. Especially after severing ties with Center for Advanced Learning, my local high school just couldn't offer that. It was not as much of a high standard school that St. Mary's Academy was. I took an academic test and scored in the 94th percentile. This let me get an academic scholarship and also apply to other scholarships. Because of the financial strain that divorce brings on parents, my mom could only afford seven, needed a $7,000 scholarship. I only got $4,000, but I got in. But because of money alone, I could not go. And I hope that in the future, students and kids cannot have doors close to them just because of financial situations. Just like with gender and race, they can't pick that kind of thing. So no doors should be closed because of it.